Hello, you beautiful ladies and gentlemen. It's Ira here, your best place for tips, tricks, video clips, and today we've got a bit of a uh, BG commentary and the first episode of Ask Ira, where you you can uh, ask me some questions, send them via mail, you know, just answer some questions about Warrior and PvP in general. So, uh, let's jump to the first question, shall we? Now, the first one is my WoW history, basically. And how did I start? Like, what was my first class? Well, I started at the very end of Vanilla, just before TBC started, and I rolled a warrior. It, I only got it to about level 45 or something. And then when TBC began, I leveled it up, but I was very, very casual. I didn't actually start PvPing until Wrath of the Lich King in Season 5, where I got a pretty decent rating on my Death Knight Warrior and my Holy Paladin. And uh, yeah, yeah, that so in Wrath of Lich King when I started PvP in, in season six, at the end of season six, I quit basically. I got banned, but I quit. And uh, I come back in season eight and leveled a brand new warrior I'm on, an, on a new account, which is this warrior you're seeing today. And uh, didn't play much because uh, it was at the very end before Cataclysm. So I played Cataclysm in season nine and got uh, glad on two, a couple of warriors and then a few teams. And uh, was a uh, rank one in Europe for a while and rated BG for 3.4k rating and yeah that's it and that's my warrior today and as you just see I just beasted on these guys in this BG no healers they're trying to get me but they're not gonna get it you're not gonna get the flag guys I'm really sorry I'm sorry but no you're not gonna get look at this feral really they're so hungry to kill me I'm on like 40k health and <laughs> they can't kill me but their people are hitting the blood decay but you know just let them whatever anyway so yeah, that's pretty much it. So I started in, uh, started playing PvP in Wrath of the Lich King. Got my uh, play Serious Arena in season nine. Got a couple of glads with that, and I've just been playing. I've always played like I was always dueling, even in like the old days. I wasn't PvP, but I was always dueling people, and that's where like if you in season eight, if you ask anyone who played me on Stormscale, it was like all I ever did was duel people basically, which is uh, why I've, I'm pretty good in 1v1s. So and look at this, ladies and gentlemen, just everyone on me. And they can't get the kill, and the ret's going down. What's happening to the DK? I don't even know what's going on right now. I'm just dinosaur damaging these people. You know what I'm saying. Okay. It's like an East Enders Christmas special for you guys, isn't it, really? It's like better than Pat dying watching me kill all these nerds. Anyway. Oh, what's the next question? Uh, let's have a look. Uh. Oh, when did I start and what rank have I been on my BG Arena RPG? The next guy asked. Uh, I was about rank 20-ish with Warrior Mage Priest. We got that to just over 2, like 2.8. We uh, played about 3k MMR. Uh, my old Warrior got about 2780, 2790. Rated BGL was 3400. I've just said that a minute ago, but it was the next question I had in line. I didn't mean to include it. Um, so yeah, they, they've dropped the flag, well, they've managed to kill it, good job guys, I managed to tank all them guys, thanks to that disc priest who come to help me at the end, I'm actually going to hand in the flag, so I'll carry on to the uh, next question, let's have a look, do, 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 do. hmm, uh, what server do I play on, I play on Stormscale Horde, with my uh, warrior, I'm under the name Oriswag, obviously, and I'm a paladin, because he asked about my paladin, I play on Ragnaros Alliance, uh, let's have the next one. Uh, let's have a look. When you do 2v2 arena, are you using PvE gear with your pro, or are you just using normal PvP gear for uh, like you would for arms? Um, I actually use a, as much PvE gear as I can get. At the moment, I'm using the braces, the legs, sometimes a weapon. But at the moment, I sort my weapon out because I'm doing raid boss two and I want to tank. So I'm using as if I got a trinket, I would swap to that as well. I'm trying to stack PvE gear because you're not going to get targeted as pro at the moment, never. So yeah, you want to get as much, but it's your basic arms, gems, reforge, everything's the same pretty much. There's not much difference, so you can pretty much go from your arms gear and use it as your prop gear. It's the same, you you have the same hit, everything's going to be the same. Um, the next question. Ooh. Would I be bored enough to make a tutorial t for prop in Arena and give you simple tips on how not to be rage starved? Uh, yeah, I would. I, c I mean, I can do these videos, just something like that takes a long time. Especially like the videos I do at the moment are just quick videos that I'm putting out and I'm while I'm making raid boss because I've been really working out you know working on raid boss trying to get it up to like a really high standard like I'm not gonna it's gonna be like especially with the nerfs coming like if you've seen the nerfs guys vengeance doesn't scale with uh yeah vengeance doesn't work with players which is kind of emotional 
I don't know what I'm gonna do. One-handed Fury PvP Inc. Nah, I'm joking. I don't even know what I'm gonna do, but we'll have a little look. But I'm gonna do a big, big raid buff thing, like a 20-minute raid buff movie, probably for a, uh, you know, for the end to mark the end of prop, basically, which is you know in 4.3, which is gonna be. Uh, let's see what the next question. Look at them! Look, they're just trying their smoke bombing. They're everything. They can't get me. It's like a rated BG or something. Just 60 k in this guy. He doesn't know what's happening. He's spinning. He's dead. <laughs> Double kill. Triple kill. Quadra kill. Am I gonna get the penta? <laughs> These guys are just feeding like mad. Oh my god, it's emotional right now. Come on, give me that penta. Oh no, he's gripped me away. He didn't want me to stay in there, Mr. Xy. Thank you for your healing. Them two priests, that goblin, Xy or whatever, and that Kirkin, Kirkin, I don't know what his name is. Sorry about that, I'm a bit old, guys. I'm sneezing all over the show and uh, snorting. Uh, let's have a look. What else have we got? Prop Paladin. Hi, Ira. I just leveled up my Prop Paladin and geared it. Saw your Prop uh, video and tried it, but I'm not doing much damage. And uh, Is there any special gems reforge? Just re Retribution reforge, mate. The same as rep. Just make sure you're using Inquisition, which is what a lot of them forget. Tri you know, that's what a lot of people forget to do, and that's a big, the huge difference between uh, the huge damage because it's thirty percent more damage. Um, also, wait for your landslide to prop sometimes. So I do that sometimes, especially as I'm fighting. I do once I got everything popped. You know, then you use your cooldowns. Yeah. Anyway, let's just carry on. I think I just got the triple kill. I'm on. I'm on this. Uh, this little retribution, this retribution, and he's not gonna die. Yeah. Oh, he does die. No, oh, thank you. Victory rush. Nom nom nom. Give me them heals, bro. So, uh, I'm just gonna run back to my. These rogues just don't give up, don't they? They just wanna kill me 24/7. Oh my lord. Okay. Oh my. It's three of them now. But at least I've got some help, so I'm probably not gonna die here. Yeah. Smoke bombs everything. Four of them at once. Yeah, there you go. Cheers for your animate. I'm just gonna try to get out there to be fair, yeah, it's grip me. I'm a little XE. Alf Key or whatever your name is. Number one priest in the world, the explorer. Anyway, the next guy. Well next question more to say. Now what have we got? Hey man, I've seen you switch from defensive stance to battle stance to burst out more damage. But why don't you switch to berserk stance? Um Yeah, I don't even know. You know what, I need to change my macro, it's just me being ignorant, I haven't even changed the macro, but Berserk Stance is better for the macro, it's just I never really thought about it, I just cause I always, like, ignored Berserk Stance, so next time I'll probably get a uh, Berserk Stance in my next video, well I probably won't because I'm lazy and I can't bother to change my macro, but yeah, it is better to go Berserker than Battle when you're doing the one shot macro, obviously, it's 5% more damage. Uh, what, what else have we got the questions, really? Hmm... Hmm. Hmm. No more questions, actually. But what I can, uh, what I can uh, reply to, what I can talk about, basically, is my thoughts on 4.3. I've just touched it very gently a minute ago, but I mean, I I don't get this change, but this uh this vengeance change. I mean, it's like they've nerfed the tank specs, and I understand Blood Decay was overpowered in 2v2, and this is purely a nerf because of the WoW forums. Like, no good player was moaning about blood decays. No one was moaning. I don't remember anyone moaning. No one moaned about prop. No one moaned about blood. No one moaned about anything. People only ever moaned at the one, at the 1600 bracket about double blood decay or blood decay rogue. That's why I'm so frustrated, really, about this change. Because it's completely ridiculous. It was unneeded. If you want to nerf blood decays, nerf blood decay, nerf death strike on players or something. Don't just re destroy the prop specs. I mean, prop wasn't even viable. I mean, I was like the only prop, like basically in the world, to go to like 2.3, 2.4k. Like, literally the only one in the world. So I don't see how it's that amazing. I mean, it's barely, vi it's barely, it's barely viable. It's not even viable in twos even. It's like every other prop I see is like 2k rated. Like there's no one else getting high ratings, like or or decent ratings, like I was managing to. That's only because I've been playing it for for the whole of Kata. I mean, it's ridiculous. There was no need to, for that vengeance change. It just, it really did annoy me. It really riled me up. Because it's like, our class is nerfed because of someone else's class being retarded, basically. I mean, if Blood Decay is too overpowered, then just nerf the Death Strike. But then that probably would affect PvE. 
and it's literally a nerf because of the forums. I mean, there was no crying about Blood Decays last patch. You know, in patch 4.1 or was it 4.2? Do, do you remember when I made my first movies and the vengeance didn't scale so quick? The, the, the cries have come this patch when vengeance goes really quick. So why don't they just revert the change they made to vengeance? That would be the most simplest thing, wouldn't it? But you know, it's Blizzard and they obviously that they're a bit retarded and they don't know how to make a game. And this is part of the reason why I'm going to Guild Wars 2, guys. I mean, I will be going to Guild Wars 2, and mainly because I've got this awesome guild called Paradigm Shift that, you know, is a really good guild, you should guys check it out. But, I mean, yeah, but at least Arena Net, I can't see Arena Net being that retarded that they're gonna just, you know, cripple three class, four class, four, four specs, basically. Because of uh, one spec being overpowered, which isn't actually overpowered. I mean, if you ask anyone who can actually play the game, decent, they'll say that blood isn't that bad in arena. Yeah, it's annoying in BGs, but you know what you do. If you see a blood decay, you get out of there. It's like as a warrior, how many years has Frost Mage destroyed us? If you see a Frost Mage, you get out of there, unless you're prop. But you're gonna have to get out of there as prop nowadays because we're not gonna have any damage next patch. So you know, it's a little bit angering and it, it vexes me a lot because. Getting nerfed because of blood decays is just ridiculous. I mean, nerf the blood decays or just revert it to how it was in the other patch where no one complained about blood decay. No one played blood decay the patch before when they did no damage because vengeance scaled slow. Just give us vengeance when we have like four people on us. I mean, how are you supposed to kill anyone as an RBG flag carrier now? Yeah, I understand that, you know, you're not supposed to kill people because you've got survivability, but let's be honest, yeah? Tank so damage is so high at the moment that uh, rogues can tank almost as good as warriors is ridiculous. I mean, in PvP, in RBG, it's literally a rogue with prep could actually tank for almost as long with like four mages on him than a, ro than a warrior can. Definitely, for sure. Which is why I'm a bit like, you know, <sighs> it's just annoying me. But then this cheered me up. This cheered me up. Boom, look at this. Oh my. Jesus. Oh my god. Yeah. I armoured the guy and he had 4.4 resi. And you know what, I could say that's broken. And you could say that's broken. And you know what, it probably is. And it probably, even Prop Warrior probably doesn't, does need toning down in BGs. I mean, it's terrible in Arena, and it's not meant to be viable in Arena, I understand that. So tone it down for BGs. So like, make Vengeance stack scale uh, a little bit slower. But don't remove Vengeance completely. It's, it's just ridiculous, man. I was having so much fun as Pro. I mean, I just... <laughs> The thing about Warrior is that it's such a boring class now. Like in Wrath, it was fun, and in the start of Cat, it was okay. But it's just been watered down to nothing. I mean, we, can't, we don't even need stances anymore. I mean, I play Arena anymore. It's like I feel like I'm playing my my Death Knight. There's no difference apart from I'm playing my, a weak version of my Death Knight. I don't know what to say about it. Oh, it's just so stupid. This change. Q Q Q Q more. I know. I'm just cuckoo, but yeah, I'd have to say that. It's stupid. Anyway, I'm just waiting for this uh, this guy to hand in the flag. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed some of that uh, that P to the PvP. It was quite fun. And uh, I got the triple cap. Got the triple cap on the flags. Just waiting for them. And remember, if you enjoyed this video, remember to like, favourite, and subscribe. Raid Boss Part 2 will be coming this week or next. It's going to be a sick movie, man. I'm working quite hard and it's going to be really, really good. I'll, there won't be that many videos this week because I'm going to be busy from uh, Wednesday onwards for a couple of days. But I should be back around, you know, Saturday-ish and making more videos for you guys. And I'll have another uh, another uh, YouTube spotlight. So if you want to get on the spotlight and you want your videos featured on my channel, you know, you won't get a ton more subs. You're not going to get a thousand more subs or nothing. But you might get a few hundred more views on your channel. And that's all it needs to be, basically. So, yeah. Uh, Thanks and goodbye guys.